Hi Rose. Hi, hi <laughs> Suzanne, how are you? I'm really good. It's so lovely to have you on retreat. Yes, it's so lovely to be here. Uh, and what, what I wanted to do is just ask you a couple of questions um, about your experiences here. So firstly, what prompted you to come on retreat? Well, I guess all the um, wonderful things I heard people say about it and how, how transformational it was. And I also have a huge high regard and respect for yourself and Peter. So I knew it would be a really quality um, retreat. And I also love barley. Oh, that's lovely. Thank you. And so what were your expectations and where do you think that the retreat excelled? So did we, have we matched your expectations? Well, to be quite honest, I, I didn't have any expectations other than I knew it would be good for me, body, soul and heart. Um, and it's exceeded the expectations because of all the deep NLP work that uh, Peter's done with us has brought out some really significant things about my life that I probably hadn't even considered before. Um, yeah, so it's really exceeded any expectations I may have had. It's oh. been absolutely amazing. <laughs> That's wonderful. And so, which techniques did you like the best? Uh, in terms of the NLP or the meditation? Either, either. Well, the NLP to me has just been amazing because I haven't come across that sort of pro those sort of processes before. I love meditating, but I've done a lot of research and, and meditated quite a bit, but the NLP was completely new and it's such a refreshing process. That was really the thing that's made it for me, yeah. And what changed for you, if you're happy to share, and what were some of the breakthroughs or insights that came along? My personal insights? Well, I guess I've always had an issue with my weight and always struggled to um, overcome it and yo-yo dieting and all this stuff. But what the process of NLP showed me was that it was a result of messages I'd been given way back in my childhood about being too fat, not being good enough, uh, not meeting the expectations my parents had of me. And it made me realise that I've actually carried that sense of not being good enough right through my life, not just in re relation to my weight loss, but things I struggle with. My go-to pattern of thought seems to be, oh, well, I'm just not good enough. But in identifying that, I, I can actually work to overcome it. Yeah, amazing. And so, coming back to the retreat, what were the things about the retreat that you liked the best? Was it the excursions, the food, the people? The well, well, the lessons, of course, were very powerful. But this environment and the amazingly friendly staff here, they know you by name, they're available for you for anything you want. They're so friendly. And this actual environment is just like heaven. Delicious and lush with swimming pools and and rustic buildings. I mean, just everything about it, I guess, is just makes for a whole incredible experience. And so if you could sum up and say, uh, you know, tell other people why they should come up, how would you do this? So what would you say to other people and, you know, why should they come along to, to this retreat? What well, definitely, if you've, had issues in your life where you feel you're blocking or you're not achieving what you would really like to achieve um, or if you're working really hard and getting exhausted and not able to find balance I think the NLP processes are just so powerful to help you change your mindset and see your life from a completely different perspective and it's so empowering and I just think it, it's uh, worth definitely worthwhile doing even if you're the sort of person who seems to be managing life really well, uh, there's always things you can learn about yourself. Yeah, and yeah. it goes deep into your unconscious, which is just amazing. Awesome, thank you. And so, in regards to Peter's teaching, what would you, how did, what, what are your thoughts about Peter's teaching and how would you describe the way he teaches? He's just an incredible teacher and a very wise man. Um, he's personable and friendly uh, but at the same time he's very organized and task oriented 
and the material that he offers is extremely difficult to grasp and he explains it in a way and gives examples in, in everyday life that really helps us to understand uh, what that particular message is. He's a really good teacher. And so, Rose, is there anything else about the retreat that you'd like to share? Anything that comes to you that stands out? Oh, the family, the relationships we've developed with the group. There's 14 of us and we've just become so close um, and we just share and love each other. And I just feel like I want to be friends with these people always. That's been really uh, totally unexpected. Oh, thank you, Rose.